there, I have a um, group of pastors that meets every Tuesday morning uh, here at church. We, the, the idea is we're talking about what we're going to preach for that Sunday. Sometimes we do, sometimes we get off track and talk about all kinds of things. On the day after the election, we're all going to meet over at Springfield Baptist Church for a prayer service to pray for the unity of the country. We're not inviting anybody to come and join us. It's going to be broadcast online, but if people were there, they would either be celebrating or mourning. It's not about who won or who lost, or if you got your way or you didn't get your way. It's about no matter how it goes, there will be people who are upset and there will be people who are overjoyed. And we're trying to pray as clergy from all the different denominations that we can come together as one no matter how it turns out. Now, for me, I'm going to have to write mine ahead of time because I'm not very good at hiding my feelings. But I'm going to write it ahead of time not knowing who is going to win. And so I encourage you also in the next two weeks to be praying for your country for unity no matter who wins, whether you get your way or not. That's what I encourage you to pray. And that's what we'll be doing uh, the day after the election. And I'll give you a link to it so you can be a part of it and witness uh, clergy from all denominations coming together to pray for our country.